హాయ్ వ్యూవర్స్ నేను మీ స్టాటిస్టిక్స్ సో లాస్ట్ వీడియోస్లో వి డిస్కస్ ది డెఫినేషన్ ఆఫ్ పాపులేషన్ అండ్ శాంపుల్ సో వన్ మోర్ టైమ్ వి డిస్కస్ ద పాపులేషన్ అండ్ శాంపుల్ సో వాట్ ఈస్ ద పాపులేషన్ పాపులేషన్ a collection of individual group of observations or things under statistical investigation is called population okay so a finite subset of population is called as a sample so next very important definition so that is as a parameter so what is a parameter so parameter is nothing but it is a constant a pop a statistical constant of population a statistical constant of population is called parameter and statistics it is a constant of sample the constant of population is called parameter the constant of stat sample is called statistics the constant of population is called the constant of population is called parameter the constant of sample is called statistics so this concept we have to use in our future so that means the concept of estimation so everyone knows that estimation we have to estimating so what is that we have to we have to the technique of estimate the population parameter along with the degree of confidence and many other related problems are provided very important branch of statistics is known as the statistical inference so in our statistical inference we have to discuss the theory of estimation so what is the theory of estimation estimation of population parameter estimation of population parameter like mean variance proportionals correlation coefficients so these are we have to estimate by using population parameter so in our population parameter the estimations uh, that means the theory of estimation was developed by professor r a fishers in the year 1930 so in our theory of estimation we classified into two types one is a point estimation another one is the interval estimation so first of all we discuss the point estimation what is the point estimation a sample of statistics that means numerical values a point of statistics numerical value we have to take is used and estimate of the population parameter so in our interval estimation the probably range is specified range is specified within which of the true value of the parameter so that is called interval estimation so first we discuss the point estimation so point estimation is nothing but a particular value of statistics point estimation is nothing but a particular value of statistics which is used to estimate a given parameter which is used to estimate a given parameter is known as a point estimator or point estimate of the parameter so uh, in our point estimation we have some good estimators so the good estimators are unbiased the one first one is a unbiased second one is consistency and third one is the efficiency and fourth one is the sufficient estimators so in our sufficient estimator unbiased estimator consistent estimator and efficient estimator any estimator 
वी हाउ टू एस्टिमेट द बेस्ट द गुड एस्टिमेटर सो द गुड एस्टिमेटर सो फॉर एग्जाम्पल वी हाउ टू फाइंड फॉर एग्जाम्पल इन अवर बाइनामियल डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन सो द बाइनामियल डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन पैरामीटर एन कामा पी सो वी हाउ टू एस्टिमेट द एन कामा पी वैल्यू सो दट इज आईज ए गुड आर नॉट सो वी डिसाइड बाई यूजिंग इन पॉइंट एस्टिमेशन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी सेलेक्ट अनबायासड सो वट इज अनबायासड सिंपली वी से दैट सो वी डिस्कस इन अवर बिगनिंग ऑफ वीडियो स्टाटिस्टिक्स सो वट इज अ स्टाटिस्टिक्स स्टाटिस्टिक्स इज नथिंग बट पॉपुलेशन सॉरी सैंपल कॉन्स्टेंट सैंपल कॉन्स्टेंट आर कॉल स्टाटिस्टिक्स सो वी हैव टू यूज दैट स्टाटिस्टिक्स सो इन दैट स्टाटिस्टिक्स वी कैन एक्स वी कैन मल्टीप्लाई expectation value so that means the expectation of statistics the expectation of statistics is equals to some parameter so we have to we get the some parameter so if you satisfy the the expectation of statistics equals to parameter then the statistics is an unbiased estimator of the population parameter for example we have to take tn is a statistics so the what is a tn tn is nothing but the set of sample observations the set of sample observations is said to be an unbiased estimator of the corresponding population parameter theta so simply write the expectation of tn equals to theta then theta is called an unbiased estimator of the theta n t n is called an unbiased estimator of the theta so thank you so everyone please give me more likes and share my video and subscribe me so please encourage and my level best